Hello everyone, this is Suburban Nights, and today I'm going to show you how to make 3D text in GIMP. So in one of my last tutorials, I showed how to download GIMP and how and what it is, so check out that video. And so to do it, you want to create a new image, file new, do the default that comes up, press OK. I'll make, I'll make the, the box bigger for you guys. OK, so what you want to do first is you want to put your text in that you want bold that you want to be 3D. So remember, if you get this from the video, remember, make it a bold text size. It doesn't work in that skinny stuff over there. So do bold. Make sure it's bold at the end. And you can do any color you want. I'll do... Yeah, I'll just stay with black. So you want to type in your text. I'll do SBK. The shorter the word, shorter the word, the bigger that it gets in the window. So I'd suggest getting, um, do a smaller word. But it works with the big, bigger words too. Okay, so I have that. You want to make the text big so you get the full effect of the three. Okay, so that's about as big as, as, gonna fit, as it's going to fit on the page. So what you want to do is you want to do command, click. You want to do alpha to selection. You want to pick, you want to make a new layer. Press OK. It doesn't matter the size. So for this layer, you want to select shrink by two pixels. You can do more if you want, but it looks better with two. You want to press OK. See, it shrinks the text. So now you can paint it any color you want. I'll paint it um, in orange. Press OK. And then I'll paint it. And you see you get two colors on top of each other, but you don't really get a 3D ish effect. If you want to press filters, blur, Gaussian blur. Let's see it blurs the layer, the new layer I just made. If you want to press OK. And so you guys can see we're basically done with the 3D text. You can press select none. You see you get a 3D type effect from the letters. And if you want to you can do more colors if you want. You just keep adding new layers and you just keep shrinking and just keep SVK, your text layer, original text layer, um, alpha to selection, and just keep making new layers and shrinking them more and more and more. But here's a hint, a helpful tip. If you're doing new layers, you should at least add two from the previous pixel size. So for this one, I did shrink by two pixels. The next one you want to shrink by four, because if you shrink by three, it's usually like close to the two pixels, so you'll overdo the, the other layer you already did. So, this was a Suburbia Night tutorial, and please subscribe.